Hey there, welcome to Life Noggin. The Earth is huge, its surface area is over 500 million square kilometers, and it currently holds over 7 billion people. But it's nothing compared to the solar system, which is billions of kilometers across, and that is still nothing compared to the Milky Way galaxy. And if we zoom out even more, we can really start to appreciate how huge the universe actually is. But we might be able to take this one step further, because we might be living in something called a multiverse, where there is not just one universe but potentially a infinite amount of them. And if this is true, some scientists think that we have the Big Bang to thank. See, for a fraction of a second after the Big Bang, the universe expanded incredibly quickly and then stopped. And over the next 14 billion years, it cooled down and formed stars, galaxies, and eventually, life. But there's reason to believe that there are some pockets of space that haven't stopped inflating, and some others that have at different times. This is called the Eternal Inflation Theory, and each of these bubbles of space forms its own isolated universe. And interestingly, the laws of physics and the fundamental constants might not be the same here. And that got me thinking. What would a parallel universe even be like? Well, in a lot of these universes, you and I might not even exist. Sorry, sci-fi fans, I know, that's hard to hear. See, if the laws of physics were different enough, like the forces between particles were too weak, atoms might never form. And that means no molecules, no stars and planets, and no life. Sounds pretty boring over there. Worst vacation spot ever. That said, there is also the possibility that the laws of physics in some of those universes are so close to ours that intelligent life is possible. And if there is an infinite amount of them, it's pretty likely that there's a bubble universe that is very similar to our own. Maybe in another universe I'm really buff and strong. Okay, I'm not gonna get carried away. And interestingly, it's theoretically possible that some of these neighboring universes can collide with each other. In fact, it's possible that our universe may have collided with others in the past. The main hypothesis is that a collision like this might have left a mark on the cosmic microwave background that we can detect. But sadly, the researchers haven't found anything so far, and there isn't any proof that parallel universes even exist. But if they do, and if they contain life, it would be interesting to see what that life was like. What do you think? Do you believe that parallel universes are out there? Let me know in the comments. And if you want to know why we haven't found life in our galaxy yet, click here to find out. Since 1960, Frank Drake and others have been scanning the stars listening for spikes in microwave radiation. But it's like trying to tune a radio with a bandwidth 15 times bigger than your cars. Earth itself has been sending radio waves into space for hundreds of years. There's a link in the description if you're on mobile. As always, I'm Blocko. This has been Life Noggin. Don't forget to keep on thinking.